Hey everybody, this is Dan from Dan's Collectibles. Just wanted to show everybody I have more finds today from a coin star. Had to go out to a few towns over and do some business and uh, stopped off at a plaza and there was a grocery store there. I didn't even know if there was a coin star machine went in, in there, so went in. Sure enough, there was one. Found a Canadian nickel on the little shelf there and then all this change in the um, return coin slot, so it was kind of cool. I got a two cent euro from Germany two Canadian dimes, two Canadian nickels, and a really cool 2000 Canadian pride quarter. This was pretty cool. It's got a big two on it. Um, two centuries, obviously, the year 2000. Two, two millenniums, I should say, it's the year 2000. Uh, it's cool, some of those have the big two colorized, like in red and blue and stuff. Those are kind of cool, but this one isn't colorized, but it's pretty cool. Some US currency, nickel, two pennies, and a dime. I put the nickel under the scope, and that shows a little bit of machine doubling. That's kind of cool. And the two, and the 1999 shows a little doubling as well, but it's just machine doubling. This penny, 999, wasn't so dirty. I mean, look at the detail on Jefferson's, Jefferson, Lincoln's head there. The, all the hair is there, the, the shirt, all the details on the shirt. It is a very nice-looking penny. I just wish it wasn't so dirty. I mean, it's got... The steps look fantastic under the scope. I just wish it wasn't so dirty. Otherwise, it's a really nice coin. Anywho, but the, the one I really liked the best was this $1 from Hong Kong. Very cool. Hong Kong. I don't get too many of those here. You know, it's a little bigger than a quarter. Here's a Canadian quarter to put it up against. Slightly larger than a quarter, but not by much. So I'm not sure it would even fit in a U.S. quarter roll, but it is cool nevertheless. As you can see, here, turn the light off and on because it shines so much. Anyway, no silver, but still interesting foreign finds. Always happy to find euros and uh, get a lot of Canadians, of course, being here in Massachusetts, but it's Find fun to find stuff from other countries like Hong Kong. You don't see that too often. Well, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, please click the like button. And if you haven't already, please press subscribe and the notification bell so you'll see my upcoming videos and giveaways. Thanks for watching, everybody.